Secretary of State Rex Tillerson is pressuring Russia to drop its support for the Syrian dictator Bashar al-Assad. They are pushing for the Russians to stop backing the dictator who was responsible for many deaths in the Syrian country. Now, we've already seen some, you know, hints at that by Putin, who stated the other day that while they do support Bashar al-Assad, their support for them is not unconditional. And we're seeing a lot of, you know, saying war, war, war on all sides of the spectrum. But the truth is, I do not think that Russia or the U.S. is willing to go out go into an all-out war over, you know, Syria. It's not, it's not worth it, and it's not realistic. But what I do see is a lot of friction and a lot of backing of opposite sides and political tension. Now, my opinion on this is that I, I don't think it's worth it for either side to get too invested in this because... You know, there's so many sides here. You have the re the moder the so-called moderate rebels. You have some moderate rebels, the Kurds, the the regime. You have Iran. You have so many players in the game. So, it, it really becomes complicated. But as of now, you know, Russia Obama wasn't too strong on Assad, so Russia stepped in and really saved his his regime when they were <laughs> close to losing. But right now, Tillerson is telling them that, you know, it's not acceptable. You can't keep supporting them. And Tillerson is actually due to meet them on Wednesday. So that will be a very interesting meeting. And I'm actually looking forward to seeing how that turns out. So obviously, this is just the beginning of this. And there's a lot that will follow. And there will be more videos from my channel. But right now... You know, I, I don't think it's as bad as the media likes to make it seem. It, it's really not that bad. It was just Trump proving a point. Yes, there's tension. Yes, there's, you know, conflicts. There's different opinions here. But as of now, really, there's it, there's not too much to talk about because I don't think Trump is really getting too invested. What happened here is that he's, he's he just he sent a message to Assad that you know, you can't, you got to follow the rules and that you can't, you know, Barack Obama is not the commander in chief anymore. So thank you very much for watching. Please subscribe. More videos to come.